guys, Jakey Bell didn't you know here. I get this a lot, but everyone keeps saying my big wing I got here is not functional. Well, guess what? I thought of another way that it could be functional. So there's people out there who have those crazy ass boosted boards, right? I'm broke as hell, I can't afford that. So what we're doing today is I'm gonna make my car into my boosted board. All right, seems legit. All right, all right, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Oh no, Stefan's struggling to do a U-turn because I don't have power steering right now. <laughs> so no, Stefan's gonna give it a shot. <laughs> I'm gonna be shit, bro. I'll go like five, 10 miles per hour, but we'll be, we'll be chilling. But then I'm gonna gun it. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, make sure you guys follow me at Genki Zenki. I post uh, my car sometimes and shit. And uh, if you guys wanna follow photography shit, it's at Stefan Van, all right? I just plugged myself. All right, so we just got back from boosted boarding, or should I say turbo boarding. Next, we're gonna jump into our next thing. We're gonna do some VR drifting in a Seto Corsa. So this is a series where we train to actually do some real life drifting. We have the drift cars, now to get some practice. So without further ado, let's hop into it. Dink start. <laughs> Oh wow, you're gonna I'm gonna take the 86 and you're gonna grab the R34. So I'm taking this Trano. Did I say Trano? Trueno? Trano. I'm taking this Trano 86 initial D beast out here. And Brando, of course, he wants to be cool and take the the R34 Skyline. <laughs> Let's get to it. This track I've never raced before. Same with Brando. But, I've never uh, been on this track. Oh my god, okay, let's see. Ooh. Oh, this is like a track track. Oh. Oh, this thing's like pretty nice. Oh. It's, oh. No, I already messed up. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Bro, I don't even, that's a, that's a hairpin. This, this is a, one. this is, this is the tightest track ever. Oh my gosh! <laughs> this is like park drift all over again. Wait, what? what? Where'd you go? Oh, it's because we're going reverse? Is that why? I see, I told oh. you. Oh! Wait, spawn in? Where are you at? I have the, uh, my, my controls are locked for nine seconds. Are you doing burnouts? No. Oh, you're just, is that just the effect? Did you just shoot mud out the, the ground or something? <laughs> okay, wait, wait, we do go down here? I think we're heading to the concession stand, man. We go left. Right. Oh, wait, I'm stuck on a wall. I'm stuck on a wall. Okay, here we go. Oh, wow, I actually got it. I actually got it. I actually got it. Whoa, no, 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 no. Dude, this track is so narrow. It's like, in real life, yeah. it's like, it's legit just two lanes. And it's just sharp hairpins back and forth. Oh my god. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think I'm gonna hang a bit now. Okay, let me catch up to you. 
I've had a drift car for so long, and like, at the rare times that I actually do get to try it, which is never, it's like the best thing ever. <laughs> right, because then it, because you're like, oh, I want to go keep doing it. Yeah. No, in my past, okay, here's the thing. I've had this 240, like this pretty nice ass 240 for about like three and a half, almost four years now, right? And I've never really got to drift or have fun with it because I built it for looks because I was a stance kid, right? So now me, a stance kid, bored of stance game, literally went to like every big show, right? Hosted my own meets, done all this cool stuff. I'm bored as hell. Now it's time to actually skid the thing. <laughs> but of course exactly. having a two Yeah, but of course having a two forty is like never working properly. But then the thing that's like making me really want to train into it now is because my buddy's like, honestly, your type two forty is always gonna be broken. You might as well just send it. I'm like, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, alright, fine, I'll do that. Exactly. Like it's always gonna there's always gonna be something little with it. But you might as well just have fun. Oh, I almost just overtook you, you little small ass uh, eight stick. <laughs> oh, you just did now. <laughs> yeah, because I, I realized something like uh, every person that comes into the game now, the best advice I give them is like, they're like, I want to build my car like this and like this and like this. I'm like, dude, honestly, get like, instead of just spending hella money and throwing money at it and just making it look nice and shit like that, just have fun with it. <laughs> this reverse entry, ready? All right. <laughs> no, I was trying to reverse it around you. Oh no! <sighs> all right, all right, ready? We got this. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, all right, and I'm gonna kick out. Okay. Oh, uh, into the grass. I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. I fucked up. <laughs> I need to buy a hydro, dude. You do. I'm tired of trying to track <laughs> where the where the button is. So. Here's the thing, Here, I'll, I'll explain to people basically what it's got. So here's the thing, you see this stick right here? This is a hydro e-brake, so in real life, you would pull this thing to, just to lock up your rear wheels. It's basically the same as your parking brake, it's just way more aggressive. And basically that's your little brake traction control. <clears throat> I have a controller that I built out of a real e-brake, right? Brando, he has to use, <laughs> let me see if I can, let me see if I can do it too. These little clickers, the little clickers that you use for, um, or paddle shifters, that's his each hydro. So the issue is, right, imagine you're flinging it like this, you're mid-drift, and then your steering wheel goes upside down. You don't know if it's left or the right one to flick. So then you're just kind of screwed either way. So. Yes. But I, now I'm just flicking. I just clutch kick it, but it just, it the hydro saves. Yeah, hydro sa saves you basically when you're kind of coming too hot and you need to get some more angle. To pit. I'm gonna fucking reverse this shit. I'm gonna go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, faster, f -f faster, faster. Okay. Wait. All right. Let me let me see if I can capture you in reverse. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did he just do that? Did he just what? That was actually pretty good. I'll, I'll give you points, bro. All right. Now that I'm a little wet, I think I can spin these tires better. Uh... <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, a little too slippery. Oh. Whoa, what that neck do? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, this is a sick livery. Uh, I like the little, little shards of geometric shapes and everything. I got a designer ass uh, S15 here. And your shit. Oh, yours looks like. Have you seen the the Brill Steel S for S15? Does yours have uh, all these cool switches to the left? Yes. Honestly, like when I see cars with all those switches, I'm just like, I can't even think of what they would all be. All I can think is like ignition, ignition fan, fan. I right, look at. Whoa! It. Someone just... else is here. Holy shit! Let's go follow. A wild Pokemon has appeared. Oh, you know what? I think this map is um, one of those public streets in Tokyo yeah. where they see all the street drifting. Yeah. Yo, this is sick. Oh, wow. Oh, this is so crazy. I, ah! <laughs> Me, my first day in Japan drifting. is <laughs> just hit a pole. Ah, dude, this, this map's this is pretty fun. This map's pretty good. Yo, I think we just had a crazy find for a map. That's awesome.
right, here we go. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh. <laughs> Whoa, this thing's so narrow. Whoa! I hit a wall. <laughs> oh my god, dude, it has to be so ballsy to send it here. Wow, this is pretty cool. I do like this a lot. You just you just get this long straight away just to try to manji <laughs> or spin like a Beyblade. <laughs> Let it rip! <laughs> I gotta go back to pits. Alright, I'll be there in a second. Oh wait, is this how you get into pits? I think like VR in a set of drifting is like that first step into like actual um, imagine if it's like ready player one like that movie was such a good movie to show like the potential oh uh. to show to show the potential of like gaming and shit like that like imagine if that stuff becomes real I don't oh like God, if, dude, if it's to that be... level I don't even know if I need a real car anymore <laughs> like exactly. you, you like in all honesty like if, if it stimulates you to that same extent you, why would you need a real car at that point Oh, this is so crazy. Just okay. You know, everyone who saw my drift video, they're like, "Bro, you fucking suck." This is how narrow the road was. I was Manji. It was only two lanes wide, man. Exactly. <laughs> it was. People are like, you suck at drift. It's like, okay, bitch. I'm like, I like to see you do it. Yeah, it was like, for for example, it's like it was only these two lanes that I was really skidding. Like. To skid on like this and just go like this and th like look I can't even keep it on the game like it's hard <laughs> are we doing it are we allowed to do it in reverse uh, nope you cannot I just found that out the hard way oh. <laughs> are you on a uh, timer yeah <laughs> yeah so if you go in reverse in like certain tracks they'll put you in a little timeout so Brandon has to stand there and just watch me for like a couple seconds while I do some burnouts on his face it's not the first time <laughs> Wow, now I'm like head to head with you. Wait, is your head right next uh, to me? Yes. <laughs> Did I go to Arizona this weekend to go see Nightmare, Kai, and I think Slander? Wow. Random fact about Brando, he's he's famous. I'm not. <laughs> he's a famous, he's a famous videographer. So I'm just another bitch with a camera. Yeah, he's another bitch with a camera that, okay, so here's the thing, there's there's freelancers and there's people who like do gigs and shit like that like on the side, like people I know, they don't get gigs like you, man, I think you're like one of those actual like legit videographers, because you literally go travel with your with all your video and stuff, right, not only that, you get to do, you actually get to film actual cool shit, not like, oh, I work for this company and I got, oh, what? this is a wall? Who you stuck on? I think it's just an invisible wall right there. Yeah, but Brando, he's he's so cool. He gets to fame with famous DJs. What kind of DJs, may you ask? Oh, he lives down the street from freaking Kaiwachi. That's 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 like the crazy. That's a cool flex. Like honestly, like for out of all the neighbors I would want to have, like Kaiwachi is that's a cool neighbor to have, man. He's a very nice guy. Yeah, even though he's huge. <laughs> he looks. You no, know, it's funny. Like. He looks intimidating, you would think like, oh, this dude's a dick. Oh, fuck, God damn it! there's that turn. You went early again? Oh, no, I'm going no, to the I pole. Went, I, went, I went late. Um, you would think he was like, you look at him and you're like, oh, he's, this dude's a fucking dick. He's just all about Jim. Like, honestly, he's the nicest guy ever and he's a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, imagine him hearing I that. Will, I, will, I will tell him that. <laughs> 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 he's like he's like a big teddy bear. <laughs> I think I everyone ev everyone knows someone like that, but you would never expect Kaiwachi, fucking a fucking person who just throws down the heaviest bass sets, <laughs> dude, <I> <laughs> just to be like a nice dude. <laughs> oh, he's the ni nicest dude ever. So he has the the Dwayne the Rock Johnson effect, like super buff guy, but su <laughs> but super nice. Yeah, <laughs> uh, that's tight. That's tight. But yeah, who are you filming wow. with this weekend? Uh, Nightmare and Slander and wow. uh, Kai. Wow. Okay. Like Kai's and Kaizo? Kaizo? No, Kaizo was last weekend. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just did Kaizo. Kaizo was last weekend. That's tight though. Dude, it, yeah, it was so sick. So how did it, how did it like all happen? Did you just like get all these gigs just meeting, uh, meeting Kaiwachi? Yeah. And he so kind of plugged I... you? 
Well, I'm under his label now. Like, I'm his tour videographer. What? Yeah. Dude, congratulations, bro. I did not know that. Yeah, yeah. So, like, uh, after Arizona, next, then the weekend after, I go to Denver for the 30th and Ohio for Halloween. <laughs> I'm gonna pick the Cressida. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna go my S13 <laughs> and throw it into a fucking wall. I swear to God, I heard like a punk emo band, and they just like that's how they talk normally. <laughs> no, exactly. They're like, I'm at the supermarket, trying to grab these sales. <laughs> I want some chips, I want some drink tonight. <laughs> Yo, two emo boys get drift cars and this is how they start. <laughs> I can't hear you over my SR20 turbo noise. All I said when I saw her is stu do 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 I'm coming after you, because it's <laughs> that mystery. <laughs> yeah, my steering wheel is not working. It's not oh. working. I might have to restart my computer. I'll be right back. Okay. Now that I'm alone drifting, I just want to say fuck Brando. You want to switch it over to COD? Yes. Because <laughs> my shit is not working. Okay, hold up. Let's... All right, let's close up the video. What's up, guys? Uh, thanks for watching today's video. Um, give us a thumbs up, a like, and maybe a comment down in the comment section. And make sure you hit that bell to the right to get some notifications on when... We post. Um, we're uh, concluding this video because uh, I'm too poor and I have the Logitech G29 and uh, it broke. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. <laughs> More to come. And then hopefully we'll actually hit the real track soon. All right. Deuces.